Hey everyone, Clint Butler here. We got another video just kind of walk you through how to add a user or a manager to your Google My Business listing. Now, the important thing is here is um, you should never turn over the ownership control to anyone. If, if the agency makes one of these for you, then make sure that you are made the owner and then they're switched to the, a manager role uh, as soon as possible. Uh, also, don't ever let anyone convince you to make them the owner saying that they have to have it. That's not true. They could be a manager. Uh, we get access to these all the time, and we call Google on behalf of our clients as a manager, uh, and it's perfectly normal and expected. So this is a business asset for you. It's very important, so make sure you never, again, never give up control of it. So basically what you do is go into Google My Business and select your business, and it'll open up the screen then click on users right here and what you get is this pop-up and then you can add more users by clicking this bad boy right here and then type in their Google email that they give you select your role I always again always select manager or communications manager if it's an agency you give them manager that allows them to do more and then click invite and that's it basically what will happen now is that person will get an email in their google inbox account uh, saying whether they want to accept the invite or not and then they'll be able to go into their google my business account and access your google my business page uh, without being the owner you can add and delete as you want as you wish so if you have uh, new employees are taking over this uh, again make them managers or a communication manager don't make them the owner because you'll lose control of it uh, i hope that helps and thank you very much for watching